A 5K walk run event was held at RAF Lakenheath to promote breast cancer awareness and to support the Susan G. Komen Fund, an official charity that the combined federal campaign recognizes. The event prompted three women to tell their story. We have three wonderful ladies who have survived breast cancer here today. September of last year, I did a breast self-exam and I discovered a lump. I get annual mammograms because my mother uh, died of breast cancer. During this most recent one in April, we discovered what looked like breast cancer. That was, that was basically how we found out. It was discovered during my mammogram and, and that was the day that changed my life. It's been a year. I've had two surgeries, one with major reconstruction, four months of chemo, about a month of radiation, several other IV treatments, and ongoing treatments. I have one that will last for about five years, and one that I'm going to start that will last for about two years. It's been a roller coaster, really, kind of trying to figure out uh, how severe it was. Originally, a, a couple of surgeries just to see if they could get it out in, uh, in lumpectomies but uh, ultimately it resulted in a mastectomy and hopefully that means that it's all, it's all out. It's, it's been hard, it's been a long struggle. I've had um, a mastectomy, I've had surgery, stayed in the hospital for over a week, six rounds of chemo, 15 rounds of radiotherapy. It's been long, it's been hard, but it's been worth it. It's been a very long year, but I've had so much support throughout friends, family, coworkers. I'll be hopefully back to work soon. I have uh, two more surgeries for reconstruction to, to go, and uh, just trying to get just trying to get better every day, and, and mentally and physically be ready to go back to work. I'm just now getting back to the point where I can uh, exercise minimally, but uh, slowly but surely, baby steps is what I'm doing. 170 people came out to support these women in their fight against breast cancer. For RAF Lake and Heath, I'm Erin First Class, Erin Mills.